So your Facebook page, yes, definitely dynamic. It's built by Facebook servers and rendered in your browser. The Udacity.com logo, not dynamic. It doesn't change very often. It's just a file sitting on a server. A blog's front page, yes, definitely dynamic. You know, a blog's front page probably takes all of the blog entries that somebody you know has written and collates them together and renders a page that you know includes you know the top ten or whatever. And Google search results, definitely dynamic. You run a search, Google in the background. You know, does a search on, on, on all of their computers, puts together results, and then renders them for you on the fly. So these are all examples of dynamic content, you know, content that's basically put together by programs. And in this class, we're actually going to be building a blog. So that's what you're going to learn how to build.